Well, good day everybody, and we haven't done a tablescape for a while, so I'm very happy to present my Afrocentric uh, tablescape to you today. What we've got here is a wonderful black and white paisley cloth that I got from a company which is a um, online company called My Table South Africa. I will um, hashtag them, is that the right saying John? Hashtag them onto my um, post so you know where to get them. She makes beautiful tablecloths. So I got this from her and um, then I got these exquisite boards from this friend of mine, Michelle Asbury, who's got a company called A Thought. And she makes all this wonderful bespoke uh, bread boards, um, cheese boards, uh, cutlery troughs, etc. Um, it's called A Thought. I will hashtag them as well. And you can either get them with the silver trim or the gold trim, which I'll show you on the other side. So what I did to, uh, this time is I went to my beloved shops, you know, my Mr. Price and my at home, but I've now found a new beloved shop by the name of H&M Homeware at the Mall of Africa in um, Four Ways, or out there. And it is unbelievable. I mean, I literally was half not breathing. I was, getting, I was so excited. So I actually haven't taken the prices off these things because I'm not gonna keep them all. So if you see the odd price, don't panic. Now uh, these wooden troughs, are from uh, H&M. No, this is from Mr. Price, actually. And there is definitely a trend in um, all the homeware at the moment to um, include wooden underplates, wooden little bowls, wooden little troughs um, for, for tableware. And I think that they are wonderful. They're very ethnic, they're very natural, and I think that they add a wonderful warmth to the table. So these are from Mr. Price. Then I've got my normal old, um, goodness, my normal old, uh, what do you call it? Table mats, the quail ones. And these plates from Mr. Price are absolutely exquisite. I just wish that I could keep them, but I mean, there's only so much you can have. They're a mosaic, which I love. And then it comes with a different mosaic fish plate or side plate, whichever one you want to say. And then I've put this little bowl, which I also got from Mr. Price, um, on top. So what you would do if you were setting the table, you'd put a dab of butter there, or some olive, some flavored olive oil and a dash of balsamic vinegar in the little bowl. And then you'd put a beautiful roll or a slice of chia butter bread in here. So that's a wonderful um, setting. Obviously the plain um, glasses, not colored for this tablescape and white napkins and I've got these um, bone uh, cutlery set which looks very very fetching on this table. So that is each place setting. Then I found these um, candlesticks at H&M and I put black candles into them and uh, I think that they look wonderful. They actually were bronze but my husband spray painted them uh, black today so that they look like ebony. So you've got that whole ebony look. And then in this range at Mr. Price, there are also these wonderful little uh, square dishes for serving things on, or snacks or whatever. So I've just put them on the side here and I've got a wonderful scented candle uh, accompanying that little uh, installation. And then this uh, black and white basket I got from uh, uh, Lock and Chisel in a, in a Lovo. It really is stunning. And if you want, if you want to look here, I've got the brass a thought uh, discs, wooden discs with the brass um, hardware on it. And I've just put um, bunches of, of, of garlic just to, to sort of 
make it a foodie table. And I've put a little sprig of herbs on the napkins. And obviously when there's a piece of bread here, it'll look stunning. And in here you can put olives, you can put oil and vinegar, you can put chili, you can put whatever is going to be um, perfect for the meal. And in this, uh, this basket, I've put some uh, proteas, which I've actually spray painted white. Not very well, I might add, but um, I think that I prefer badly sprayed proteas to fake proteas. So that was my, my point, but I ran out of paint and anyway, don't you must have run out of, out of paint, but I did. But this gives the whole story a nice monochrome black and white um, theme. And I think once you put on the butter or the olive oil and the bread and um, fill your glasses with wonderful water and ice, I think it'll be the most beautiful table to sit at. And um, as I say, I'll hashtag all the um, suppliers, the Mr. Price, the a Thought, the My Table South Africa, and obviously um, at home and H&M Home. And um, I hope that you are going to enjoy this. What I will be doing going forward for Christmas, I'm gonna have lots of tablescapes coming up that will be available from my classes to actually buy the whole thing. The napkins, the tablecloths, and all the little bits that we're going to come up with. So that's what we are going to be looking forward to. And I hope that you have enjoyed this tablescape, which I have been remiss in posting for, I'd say, three or four weeks. I can't even remember when I did the last one. I can't even remember what it was. That's the worst part. That's what happens when you get old. Anyway, enjoy everybody. And I hope you've enjoyed this monochrome um, scene. My dog uh, matches the the scape. Come here, Lucy. Come, darling. Come and look at the scape. Well, she matches the whole scape as well. And we're all good going forward. So see you again soon. Bye.